All right, so, you know, we're all here. First month of 2024, the month where everyone tries to start their resolutions. You know, one thing I wanted to do for mine was just make sure I was bringing the best content I could for you guys. I wanted to find the most abstract, abstract obscure, obscure, but great, great indie games I could. And I want to bring those weird ones, those really bizarre, creepy ones. So today we're about to play a game about investigating a colon. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really know about uh, So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome to Revenge of the Colon. Man, what the heck is that name though? In this game we play as a doctor who performs colonoscopies. <laughs> Okay, hang on, let me just compose myself. Look, man, someone's gonna do it, okay? But we're doing our best to help people out. We gotta help these patients. This is a weird body horror game. I've seen some previews on thumbnails and stuff. It looks very, very weird. And that's exactly why I'm down to see what this is all about. It's gonna be a longer, less edited video. If you guys are down for this thing, you know exactly what to do. But how about we go ahead and uh, check what people got out their buttholes, huh? What is wrong with you? You are a gastroenterologist. That's a big word. Gastroenterologist. Gastroenterologist. We enter the gastro. A specialized doctor with expertise in diagnosing and treating diseases of the digestive tract. One of the most common procedures you perform is the colonoscopy. In the insertion of a camera deep into the large intestine via the anus. You have been performing colonoscopies for decades and have treated thousands of patients. You are well respected among your peers and a regular speaker at all of the important annual conferences. You have seen it all and treated it all. Nothing phases you. There is nothing you can't handle. You do not know it yet, but this is your final week. What, what, what do you mean though? Oh my gosh, what is that though? Why is this loading screen? Hang on! My final week? But... I'm so good in my field. Yeah, maybe Monday. Lost treasure. Ain't about to be lost for long. Hold up. Were they hiding that from someone? It has been nearly 70 years since I've been on holiday abroad. And I have been watching the news about border control guards and their brutish behavior. After we arrived in Calais, we were waiting in line and I saw a hard expression on the guard's face. It gave me such a fright that I took up my wedding ring and swallowed it. Oh gosh. I thought he might take it from me. Eventually we passed through the border without any trouble, although he was quite rude. He didn't speak any English at all. Then it's been over a week since we have returned and my ring has not reappeared. It is quite likely that the ring did leave your body and you simply did not see it. No, I'm quite sure it has not come out. My husband Harold has much better I said that I have, and he has done all- You certainly have a dedicated husband, Mrs. Hargreaves. I think we should get started. I'll give you a moment to get into position, and let's begin, shall we? Thank you, Doctor. Yeah, alright. I mean, look guys, someone's gonna do it, right? I mean, look, she didn't want to lose her wedding ring, she uh, gulped that thing down. It goes through the body, and now we're about to uh, try and find- it. Where's this wedding ring at, though? Oh my gosh. And so we've entered. The large intestine. We can move like this. Look around very slowly. Oh my goodness, what is what is it? Okay, we go up and down. Yo, this these controls. What the freak is going on here? Are we really this slow? Are you you kidding me though? Dude, we really we take our sweet time. Look at that. Look around. Uh okay. Okay. Well then. This is great. This is uh it's fantastic. So away we go. Through the uh large intestine. We're looking for a wedding ring. And, uh, yeah, we're hopefully gonna find it huh? pretty fast. Scanner. Use this instrument to scan and analyze anything found in the patient's colon. Next tool. Grabber. Use a tool for pulling objects free that are stuck or pierced into the colon. Ouch. A high-powered precision surgical cutting device. Okay, we got it all. Cauterizer. No patient should be left with a bleeding colon. This instrument will quickly close the wounds and fur stop further blood loss. And we got the flusher. Flush objects, dead flesh or anything out of the colon with a warm jet of water. All right, so, uh, we really got everything here. Look at this, guys. We got the scanner. Out of range. Uh, I'll still scan around, though. Okay, why does it sound like this up here? Ma'am, did you swallow an MP3 player, too, with built-in speaker? We're gonna find that thing, too, as well. Yeah, I can scan as much as I want. Uh, whoa, holy crap, that's kind of fast. So look at that. Ah, ooh, ooh, what's, what's this? That's no wedding ring? At least that ain't a wedding ring I've seen before. Find a way to identify anything that looks suspicious. Ma'am, what you been eating? What is this? Scan this thing up. It is, let's see. A colon. Oh my gosh. The best trim is to cut it out and have it analyzed. All right, dude. Well, I look. Body horror game. I said it was going to be one. Very weird one. So, uh, away we go. Ah! Oh, that look, that's careful, right? And then we want to go over to number five. Okay, rinse it down first of all. Number five. And cauterize that thing. Okay. Holy crap, bro. How long is this going to take? We're going to get them all the way out, though? You've got to be kidding me. We're going to be here forever. No way. Oh my goodness. Hey, someone's gonna do this job, and uh, I'm glad I'm only doing a simulation. This is boring as free. What the heck? Okay, so we know these are all here. I'm gonna get past them all and then do it to optimize my time. So first of all, we'll do on this one first of all. Hang on, map. I got. I know you might be screaming out there, but don't worry about it. We're a doctor, right? Best in our field. I'm sure you only feel a little bit. Here we go. Four tries. That one. Next one. Get the job done. 
I can I can see myself becoming a master at this thing very quick. Okay, so that's all done. Now let's uh, start flushing these things out, right? A little handy dandy uh, super soaker. But for the colon. It's, uh, it's a colon soaker, basically. Okay, let's look a little bit more. Feels weird saying that, but we want to make sure our, our uh, patient is fine. What is that, dude? The heck is that? That's a that's a giant polyp though. What the freak? Okay. Well, I mean, look, someone's got to get rid of that thing. So I'll get this. I am just going to uh, make my way all the way up after this because what's the point in doing this? Washing it out, then come back, doing another one, washing it out. We'll just group them all up together, optimize our time as a doctor. I'm sure she would like that also. It's about the wedding ring though, right? It's about the wedding ring. And I ain't seen it. Don't make me wash stuff up here. Though. What's this? Bloating cell? What the freak? Hold up. Do I go more then? I got more. We still got work to do back on ourselves, but I want to see. Dude, her colon has loading zones. What's going on? I hope it's safe where they are back there, though, you know, because uh, someone's going to go back after we're all done here. No wedding ring, though, so that's that's kind of weird. But again, I'll just uh, coast through this thing, fly through, don't jab any of those edges, and we are all good to go. Dude, another one. But if I wash that thing, how am I going to get it out? That Okay, that's going to be a nightmare to remove. Are you serious right now? I'm gonna be here forever doing this thing, dude. Hold on, hold on. Let me just clean this one out. Hang on a mo- Oh, it just explodes everywhere. What a messy job. What a freaking messy- Are you serious? It ain't done yet, though? Come on, hurry up. Thank you. I'm busy here. Oh my good lord. What the heck is this? Hey, uh, ma'am, I think I found why your uh, wedding ring may have gotten stuck. What the heck is this thing? Not every alignment can be treated the same way. What is this? Hardened deposit of fat and calcium. It become bigger over time, causing a blockage. It should be removed. Okay, experiment with your tools. Uh- Grabby. Oh, that's got some. Oh, see the pig though? <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Hey, I'm getting so much leverage right now. Patience, 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 patience. Come on. Please. Yeah, you just gotta let go now. Come on. Ah! No choice. Go at it, go at it, go at it. Okay? Gotta break it down, right? Come on. Laser, maybe? Ooh, fat and calcium. Burn it off. Oh, ew. This is disgusting. What the? Genuinely gross. What the freak, bro? Ooh. Um, I mean, the water kind of carries it. Just a little bit. Oh, my goodness. Guys, are you watch this far, man? Uh, what the heck? What are you curious about this for, you know? But also, I'm the one playing it, so that question also goes back on myself. There you go. Make your way right now. That's it, guys. You single file that. Yeah, that's uh... <laughs> Yeah, it's a good fat calcium deposit. I don't know if like these loading zones mean you have to clear things out in between every one. It's a little confusing. Ah, uh, what the freak is, man? What have you been shoving up the per the pear drops up your butt? What is this though? Hang on a moment. A hard boiled sweet. Uh, all right, but man, you, you know you're supposed to enjoy that. Like, uh, not this way. So I have questions. Melt this down. Break it down. Nope. Okay, let's try this. Break the sweet down. Come on. Crack it. Oh, this thing's stuck on. I mean. We could probably pull this thing off, right? Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Come on, it's just a little bit of sugar. Yes, man. Yes, that's how we do it. There you go. On your way! And uh, make sure she doesn't think it's a fresh one, Doc, because that ain't going to be weird. Just joking. That's going to be the weirdest thing ever. Push it into the darkness. Maybe that's enough, right? Once we see it just disappear, we are good. We've got some range on this thing. The crawl continues, though. It's the wedding ring we're after. Not any of this. And I haven't seen a single thing. Am I going to get another loading zone soon? I'd rather not, man. I'm worried that I'm, uh, you know, not gonna go back on myself once I'm done. What the freak are these, dude? More sweets? What is this? Sweet corn? That's sweet corn. The pieces. Oh my. <laughs> Get these things out. They're gonna, they're gonna make their own way out, though, right? Like, I, I don't gotta do this, but. So I guess I'm gonna, because I'm, I'm that much of a good doctor. I even aid in my assistant's uh, passing of objects. I'm fearful about, like, what, what the heck's gonna happen with these next levels, though? This is, this is weird. I'm actually kind of, like, genuinely freaked out. I don't know what I was expecting playing this game, but this kind of wasn't it, though. It probably should have been because it's about as weird as expected. All right, cool, cool, great, a bit more. Okay, all right, why is that still bleeding? Bro, another loading zone, like, I don't get it. I don't, like, I'm going deeper in, so like, why would I like not instead on the way out get rid of everything instead of on the way up? Because then I have to do it again. That's my thinking as a smart doctor who optimizes my time and ensures my patient's safety and most comfortable experience. What do you think they're talking about out there, you know? Ah, oh, madam, this is the strangest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, I know, doc. I'm not gonna lie, I just wanted to see if my wedding ring tasted. Ma'am, what are you talking about? I don't know, doc. I, I really don't understand myself sometimes either. Like, why would I want to do that? I'm getting quick at this now, though. Now that I'm on the par, look. But come on, come on. Burn up! That little one was holding on for dear life. Did you see that? Get this one. 
There you go. As we come through, and then we come up here. Get this thing off. There you go. Optimization, right, guys? Optimization. That's how we do it. Exactly how we do it. There's that one. Okay, what the heck's going on up here, though? This is where it uh, looks like we might find the ring. And uh, a lot more stuff. Oh my gosh, we're getting busy up here. What the heck is all this? Look at the efficiency. Look at the efficiency, all right? Don't even switch towards. Wait until we're done here. Hey, there you go. Oh, this is going to be very, very cumbersome. That's the first one. We'll quad tries when we're done. So we probably should uh, not be doing it like this. Maybe it's better the other way. One more. Okay. Yeah, I'm actually going to sort this out. This is uh, messy. Is that not working though? What's going on? There we go. Finally. Oh my goodness. It's like they get worse if they're left longer. What the? Hey, ma'am. Uh, you lose your dentures too. How? Two front teeth? What's this? What the freak is going on? Broke a piece of denture. Yeah, maybe, but how is that even there? Just because there's so much, I'm going to clear the field a little bit. Yep, yeah, on your way out. That's it, guys. Single file, one-way system. Keep to it. This is a strange one, right, guys? This is a very strange one. Very strange. I don't know if that's enough. Like, once we see them disappear, that counts. Push them out of sight, out of mind. And hopefully they uh, continue their own little journey. We give them a leg to start. And they just know it. They know exactly where to go. Look at them. They almost made me sad seeing them leave. You know, it's like an old friend. Farewell, fat lumps and sweet corn. Oh, yeah, and, and dentures. That was another thing. That was another thing. Let's not forget the dentures. I'm starting to doubt she even has a wedding ring up here, man. I think maybe she mistook them for the dentures. Like, what else has she got? I already thought, like, dentures was going to be enough. Wait. Oh, there it is. There it is. The pride and joy. The ring. You know, I'm going to tell her we don't have it, bro. I'm going to tell her we couldn't find it. You know? <laughs> we got to scan this. What is this? What is this bizarre little thing grappling onto it? Excuse me, scan this up. An ancient piece of chewing gum? Permanently stuck. Oh my good lord. We're going to have to burn that thing away. A lovely, yep, Miss Hargreaves lost treasure. And uh, lost it is. I guess we've got to burn this down, chewing gum. Dissolve it again. Uh... Maybe, maybe pull this thing off, you know, do it the old-fashioned way, like, hey, there, hey, come on right now, you can break off, pop the ring. Yes, sir. So this is permanently fixed here. They weren't lying about that. Okay, here we go. Don't, don't burn it, what are you doing? Don't scan it either. I can just glide back with it. We don't even have to watch this, guys. Look at this. This is how we do it. I mean, we got what we needed, right? This was the whole point of our little adventure. We end our little uh, expedition. I wish this thing had, like, legs, though, man. We could speed out all the way through it. Pretty cool device. So what, we just glide around it like a little mini drone? <laughs> what the heck is this? Here we go. We're getting the ring back. Do we really have to do this all the way? This is seriously going to take forever. Like, I get it. You know, it's kind of a doctor's job. But my gosh, I'd rather just pretend to be doing this. Oh, look, it's just going. They're both just going. Look at that. It's like the current just brings it. Maybe that's how it works. Like, do this so it flows down. And it should, uh, you know, make its own way out with everything else. I think we're good. I think we're good. We washed everything out. We just got to see now. Do we have to really do the whole crawl back? Uh-oh. I mean, I don't think we do. I'm just saying, oh, because I don't want to see that, to be honest. Did we do it? Today was a good day. After you rinsed off Miss Hargreaves' ring, you watched with delight as she slid it back on. Ah! <laughs> you will be telling colleagues, friends, and relatives about Miss Hargreaves for years to come. Good anecdotes are hard to come by. You went to bed chuckling to yourself until you fell asleep feeling happy. This was the last normal day. What else? Hold up. That's a normal day? I thought, like, wedding rings at buttholes were strange enough. What else happens? Last normal day? Okay, alright, chill out Tuesday. We haven't even seen it yet. Pika? It is uncommon for someone as young as you to require a colonoscopy. But when I saw your x-ray, I was quite shocked. I could not distinguish what was happening inside your large intestine. For over a year, I suffered from a condition known as Pika. That's the other guy, I guess. I craved and ate things that are not food. It started off harmlessly. I would eat the eraser at the end of my pencils. And I would eat small bits of paper or small bits of plastic from food packaging. I cannot remember everything I ate, but I do know that I ate a lot of different things. Recently, I began to crave metallic items, and I began eating small coins. Paper clips, small screws. Oh my gosh, steel nails! I was hospitalized after I collapsed work. Surgeons removed 30 objects from my stomach. There are still objects in my lower bowel which are difficult to remove. Then doctors referred me to you. Hmm, yes, yes. Mm, very strange. Yes, hold up. It sounds like you've had a very difficult time. Are you still having these cravings? When I was in the hospital, I was diagnosed with malnutrition. I've been having money troubles for a while and I have not been eating as well as I should be. Doctors put me on a special diet and gave me a lot of high dose dietary supplements. I have not had any cravings since the treatment started. This is fantastic. I wish you continued recovery. Thank you. We will do things slowly and methodically and carefully remove all the remaining objects from your bowel so you can get back to living a normal life. Wonderful. Yep, yeah, let's, uh, 
do our job one more time, right? <laughs> and they said this one's gonna be the last normal day. Well, that normal day's gone. So what's about to go down here? Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Do what we need to do and make our way out. This looks uh, a little bit inflamed, ma'am. I think, is this what inflamed looks like? So to fire a colonoscopist, whatever the term would be, coming right up. This game's gonna give me all the knowledge I need, man. Problem is, I don't wanna do that. Whoa, whoa, I'm seeing a water fountain on the go. Cauterize it straight out. Whoa, not the best thing to see straight away. We go through and we uh we keep busy. I'm trying long range shooting. Wow, ah, no wonder you're in pain. Oh my goodness, this is bad. It's real bad. Come on, there's your range. Got it, got it. Oh my goodness. Dude, so we gotta probably use the grabby for this thing and then quarterize it. I mean, we can scan it. You can use that for holding up your fence, not holding your large intestines together. Thumbtack, pull it out carefully. Okay, carefully now. Come on, come on, come on. Get out, get out. Dude, that nail's got some, what the freak? I can't even get out, hold on, hold on. Dude, look at that. Hanging on for dear life. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, no, don't make it worse, what are you doing? You're here to treat the problem. Make the thing worse. There we go, and there goes the thumbtack. Don't you dare tell me that thing embedded in again, because I am not dealing with this, okay? Maybe a doctor, but I ain't a thumbtack, a large intestine remover thing. Maybe I am, though. Have we got some coin? Hold up, that's some ancient relics right there. Valuable coin? Oh my gosh, it's the famous 1960s um, Queen Elizabeth coin, which is very rare and not in circulation. I should definitely keep this one to myself. It's like, you know, vending machines when you press the, uh, like, eject button? Like, that's, that's what's happening here, guys. That's literally her colon. Grab, pull, uh, grab, pull, uh, treat, just like this. Great. Okay. What is this? Hold up. Are those are more tags or something? But what's joining onto it? A thumbtack. Okay, so that's good. We know what they are. Those are actually the ones I think we removed, so send them on their way. Goodbye, guys. Farewell. Everything else. How do we remove this? That thing's coiled into the system. Hang on a moment. A thin shaving of metal. Remove it carefully. Um, I don't think there's any way I can really get rid of this thing with, like, being careful particularly. Just gotta pull this thing. Dude, that's bad, man. What the heck? Glad this thing has been treated for. This damage that will be occurring. I don't even dare to think about, like, the pain and discomfort. Wash them out. Hopefully they don't, they don't get caught on anything else on the way out, because, uh, definitely... Yeah, they're falling down there. They're just tumbling. So, okay, she was, uh, she was extremely hungry for metals, huh? Back when that thing was, uh, acting out like that. Excuse me. Get out of my way, man. I'm trying to treat this lady. Don't get interference from things like you. Get the coin out of the way. Bro, this is not stopping bleeding. Okay, finally. Oh my gosh, I was worried that thing wasn't gonna stop right there. Remove that. Let me do my job. Let me do my thing. That's it. And wash this all away. Wash this all away. Goodbye. Goodbye. Glad to not see you again. Now they say get your iron in, but not like this. Not like this. Is that a real condition? For some reason, I feel like it would be. Like a kind of realistic thing that some people unfortunately experience when uh, malnutrition might strike. And if so, I'm, I feel awful for those people. Even though it's a game, I'm glad I can help them out, you know? Stop whatever's going down here. Rinse this away. Keep on the flow. And uh, this can also keep on the flow. Ah, uh, finally, something normal. Ah, uh, look at this. Lone piece of sweet corn. Yeah, I'm used to seeing you. You can go out. There's your way, good stuff. Oh, ouch. Okay, can this robot have like two grabbies so we can connect this thing together so it's not gonna uh, pop out in between? Cause that's rough, bro. Like that, like that. Come on, out with the way it should. Uh, uh. Body horror is definitely the way you would describe this to someone who's playing this, right? Just a little bit. Very strange. Okay, come on, we need that. There we go. That's what I think it is, right? The classic pollock, or however you say it. I'm not quite the connoisseur when it comes to pronouncing my medical stuff. The thing is with this one, this could this could be literally endless because uh, we gotta go all the way through. We gotta get as many of these objects out as we can and just, you know, keep going, like, through the whole system here. Someone's gonna do it, and that's gonna be us on this occasion. These, are, hold up. Nails out? Oh my gosh, there's so many. Steel nail. Carefully remove it the way it's uh, supposed to be in Oh my okay, that makes me feel sick man actually makes me feel sick if We don't do this properly man. This is gonna be messy as heck. Oh my look this one's bent as well. How? You know, it's just it's Bad bro. This is bad. I'm gonna treat all these before and I think should I though? There's so many maybe I can't have the time to like this, yeah, this is jacked up, bro. This is not. I'm just hearing water pouring around me. It ain't a good kind of water, I'll say that. It is, uh, lots of red. Lot of red. Any more? There should be some. Maybe not. Maybe not. We're good. Inty wincy spider. Skip to the end. And the rain washed it all out. Something like that, you know? How do they treat this in someone? If this is actually the case, like, 
I'm genuinely curious. I'm not searching this up. No, no way. Like, I'm going to stay curious, but seriously, though? Yeah, get all of this out, and then we'll continue working. Sheesh. On your way. Wait, what's that? Why does it sound like that? Why is the music... Like, why is it with this horror music? I get it's kind of body horror, but... My gosh. I didn't realize dogs has had this horror experience every time. I, I mean, I get, you know, this stuff, but usually they're like, mm, yes, yes, I will cauterize the wound where I see. Dogs has got this music playing in there when they're operating on me and stuff. I'm wondering if I could just kind of like grab this put over there, for example. And then the moment I do this, just a little bit whilst I'm going away, is that enough? Because that would be, yeah, that would be much better if so. Is that battery? Oh my, you trying to charge your butthole so you can poop faster or something? Move that. Uh, let's, yeah, sure. Acid or alkaline battery, you know? Uh... A battery. Yep, needs to be. Well, I'm flushing everything out. I think everything needs to be flushed out to prevent poison, you know? How long's that been there? How long has that been there? Excuse me, let me just get around this side here. Let's uh, propel you on your way. You just keep following that way out, sir. I'm talking to a uh, double A battery, guys. I may have lost my mind a little bit. You know what I hate the most about this? There's an odd sense of satisfaction I'm getting from doing this, guys. I can't explain it, but there's something inside me which says, like, you're finding enjoyment in this. This is fun. It's soothing. Nice. Right, think about that. To cleanse the large intestine is to be a soothing experience. All right, come on, Doc. We're going in. We went through that large intestine. What the fr- oh, okay, what the heck? I got closed doors. Hang on a moment. What the heck's going on here? I get some pennies. And those pennies out. Why- why we gotta be a colonoscopy in the- like, colonoscopist? Colonoscopist? Like, we're a UK one, bro. Those UK folks, man, we, uh, we find those, uh, one pennies that are tasty, man. What can we say? It's the way they rust. What is this? Oh my gosh. Is that one of the coils from the reverse way? That thing is not looking good. Piece of bob. Oh my goodness. That's gotta go. That's uh, that's gotta go. Messy before I got here. How long has this been doing this for, you know? You know, first of all, where there's uh, nothing going on, we're gonna save the uh, the razor until last, and we'll take care of that. Actually, skip it. Let's just get out of the way, right? Remove it. Warize this up. Ooh, good lord. Okay, okay. It's weird, because I thought it was going to be more, like, optimized that I played this game, but there's just so much more stuff that now is just in the way all the time, so... As a result, I'm, I'm spending longer on the job. Look, like, what is going on here? Why won't this stop? Watch these out. There you go. Good stuff. Continue on our way. It is interesting, because it is, like, a huge game of patience. Like, I have the chance to... I can cut corners here, but I'm choosing not to. And so as a result, it makes the game take much longer to do because I want to get these, uh, you know, these operation things. I want them done properly. Like, I do want to be a doctor I'm going to be recommended to. Like, uh, the more people I do a good job with, the more friends are going to want to visit, right? More flush. I think it's as long as you do that. Because if I look away and look back, sometimes they disappear, man. I mean, that, that must mean that it's just gone. Okay. So, nice and clean. Just as we like it. Wait, wait, wait. Another battery. She didn't just find one. Oh, she found two of those suckers at the same time, man. That's got to... Wait, 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 wait! That's not a battery. That is uh, something a little bit different. Shotguns? What the? Let's do this. Because water ain't gonna make that thing fire off, right? If we quarterize that, I feel like the game would do that, man. Oh my gosh. I'm glad I kind of thought at least decently quick on my heels. That could have got really bad. All right, that'll be the end of that one. You really made a difference with today's patient. It had been a long time since you have removed so many dangerous things from a colon. You feel satisfied to have improved someone's life. To celebrate, you enjoy a large pizza with your wife and fall asleep watching old TV shows. Hey, that sounds like a pretty nice way to end a Tuesday, but then came the next day, which probably got weirder. It is Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> I've been a fisherman for almost 17 years. Every day I go out to the sea and return with what nature gives me. Everything I eat comes from the sea. It is a cold, lonely, and often a dangerous life that requires a lot of strength. Recently, I feel like my strength is being slowly sucked away. I've become tired before I pull in the first catch. I feel hungry all the time, even after eating a big meal, and I am losing a lot of weight, which scares me the most. I have always been overweight, but in the last few months, my weight has gone down over by a- Whoa, a third? Holy crap, this is kind of serious then. I'm worried I will waste away to nothing. You said that everything you eat comes from the sea. Yes. Are you eating fish straight from the sea without cooking it? Ah, hang on a moment, wait. It is so fresh that there is no need to cook it. Well, various species of parasites live in the flesh and f of fish and other sea. 
Oh no, it is possible that you have ingested some of these parasites and they are the cause of your problems. But I have eaten like this for many years and have never had a problem. People with parasites may not always show symptoms until the parasites are large in number or in size. So they've been growing, they've been feasting on the fish he keeps eating. It can take a while for them to grow and reproduce. I suppose you may be right. I do get weird feelings in my gut sometimes. I feel things twitching and moving about. Moving up. Oh, this is actually making me feel kind of sick, dude. Yes, the feeling I get is in my guts. It reminds me of what I see every day. A writhing pile of fish. Oh, I am sure it's nothing like that at all. But there is only one way to find out. Rubber gloves, they come on, man. Make yourself comfortable and we shall begin. Let's go deep sea diving, but the other kind. Yes, Doc. I am making weird jokes about this. Uh, why would kill though for an acceleration burn for real, just so I can speed through this? Cause it's a slow drift. I get you gotta be careful on this type of job, but man, does it take a long time. And I could be just done here so much faster. That does not look like a parasite, but I could be wrong. What is that? Piece of poo poo? It actually, hold up. It, I, it's not from it. Wait, what? I got things pooing where my poo should be. My poo poo might be pooping, hold up. Classic polyp. Classic, man. I love those things. Good old Polly, man. Good to see you again. Huh? How you been? How you been, huh? Yeah, I treated your friends yesterday. They're in someone else's body. So, uh, good to see you again. Hopefully you do well. See you on the next one, right? Because I know you'll be back. Yeah, it's like one of those games where it makes me almost want to take it serious because uh, it's kind of disturbing what we got to do on this job. Like, we've really got to help people out. These might be real problems. Like, I don't want to know if the, uh, the person who, uh, you know, searched up for this game knew these were real things that were going down or uh you know if they weren't because it could be weird to know that this is actually something that can happen in the human body not to creep you guys out just don't eat raw fish okay like why are you doing that anyway this is actually making me feel a bit sick man like honestly it's actually making me feel nauseous a little bit all the concept of all this this is w Ugh, nasty it's really kind of hit me what i'm doing right now and I, you know it's about funny commentary me speaking smack whilst i'm doing this but Okay. Oh no. Oh no. They're moving. They're moving. Don't don't tell me those are eggs. Don't 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 oh wait, dude, those things the freight hold up. Let me see. Some kind of unidentified aquatic blood sucking thing. Why is there so many? Why is there so many? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I don't know why you're here. I don't know why I'm here. Yo, this is actually disgusting. This is so disgusting. <laughs> Legs twitch as well, man. Oh my gosh. Yo, if this is your first video on the channel, let me just say, this is, uh, this ain't the norm. This is not the norm. Well, it could be if you want me to play more often, though, you know. Get this junk out of here, man. Get all of it gone. Come on, be gone. Why is there so many? I don't like that there's so many, bro. I hate that there's so many. I really do. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like any of this. I really don't. Genuinely feel sick about this. Why did we have to have a speaker attached to this? So we could hear these things doing this sound. Like, come on, bro. What were you thinking? Seriously. I know we have a time limit on this as well, but, you know, that'd be kind of weird. So do that. It's like you can hold it in the same spot once it finishes to also double down court-wise the rune. I need to uh, get into a habit of doing that. I hate how the legs still twitch, though. Genuinely hate how they keep... They shouldn't do that. They shouldn't do that. But yeah, they do. They just keep pretending that they're attached to a living thing still, bro. <laughs> so weird. This is outrageous how many there is. Like, genuinely Irish. No wonder this dude's weight drops so much. These things have been feasting on what he's been feasting on. Like, he gets the nutrients from the food, and then they get the nutrients from him. It's the perfect circle of life, but this should not be the perfect circle of life. It really shouldn't. The British people, they be eating weird things, guys. What can I say? Like, fresh? We just like them fresh. I blame Subway for teaching me that one. Eat fresh, you know? I, I didn't know. I thought this is what it meant, but... Okay, now I know. Thanks, thanks, Subway. Okay, down with that one. Here you go. Use a super soaker on that. There you go, a little bit of encouragement, that's all it needs. Don't tell me there's more of these things, dude. I'm already freaked out from doing this. I don't want to do this for another, like, two to three portions of the colon. I'd love it if we just glide through this, just like this. It's just a lot of this. Boring gameplay, but at least it stops us having to treat the- Oh, I'm- Okay, we got problems. It seems like you can hit these in, like, any direction you want. I hate this game. It's, like, slightly crossed- Oh, it's slightly crossed the phone. Ew. I hate this. I hate this so much. Dude, this is making my head feel weird. Oh my god, I don't like this. I don't like- I didn't even read that. Oh, It's better to remove it. Oh my- With the grabber? Guys, I feel- I feel really uncomfortable. I'm getting like head fuzzes from this game as a concept. I get really weird about stuff like this, man. I'm gonna actually put a warning on this. Do I do this too? To finish the job? Push them out. I hate- I Yo. 
I'm genuinely getting fuzzy from this. Like, I hope you guys know I'm not just I'm not just saying this. I really do feel uncomfortable. I, I want to get this done as quick as I can. Lesson learned, don't eat, don't eat fish straight from the sea, guys. You know what? Sushi? What sushi? Never heard of it. Never gonna hear of it. This is so sick. This is absolutely vile. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna optimize this. I'm gonna get these out. Wash them all down at the same time. How about that? Have some fun, yeah? So is it these these things doing the poo-poo? These things doing poo-poo? These things doing poo-poo? What is this, dude? What is that? And why isn't it moving? Is it like a bone or something? Fish bone? Fish bone. Right, got it. It's, it's a fish bone. Same technique then. Do that, cauterize the wound, and we wash it out. Ooh, what are those, dude? Ugh. What is that? Dude, I'm, I'm struggling to commentate this game. I just feel sick. I genuinely feel so sick from this. I don't, I don't want to scan. I don't want to know what it is. Remember when we said it was like an unknown thing? I want to keep it that way. I do not want to know what the heck all of this junk is, bro. I don't. Hey, speedrunners, you want to speedrun this game? It's jacked up if you said yes. I'm, guys, I'm curious. I hate that I'm curious. I should not be curious about what this thing is. But I see an egg. Just, 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 just do this. Just do this. Hey, oh, God. we're going to have to do this. It's disgusting. It's, this is so gross. Now, guys, the satisfaction is actually diminishing with this game. It's just disgusting. And that's a lot of disgusting, to be honest. It's all there is. What, what is this? Hard deposit of fat. Oh, right. We got to, we got to uh, cauterize that one. Yeah, it's just, it's a lot of the same, though. Like, what's satisfying? Now it's just like, okay, I get it. Like, can we do something different now? It's kind of boring, to be honest. Why is there so many? Oh, my God. I don't want to do my job anymore. I hate my job. I hate my job. This is just so monotonous. It's actually, it's gone from body horror to just like, okay, the horror is that we just don't ever like do anything different. I'm bored. I don't want to do this anymore. Okay, I'm gonna work like this. Pull everything out, wash it all down, and then seal up the uh, problematic zones just like this. Hopefully this is gonna speed the job. We have to be more optimal here. And this person's gotta be like, I wanna eat my raw fish again, Doc. Why am I still waiting here? What's going on? It was your fault, sir. That's why you shouldn't do this for years upon years upon years, thinking there's no consequence. Please, more of this. Please, just a clean colon. I have never been, like, so desperate to just, like, just see this. It's odd. I never thought I'd be in this position, but one hour ago, I didn't think I was really going to be playing this game. Like, it sounded too weird to be true, but it, no, it's true. Oh, man, don't tell me we're going to do more. Come on. What is that? More of these, huh? Be efficient. Be efficient. Remember? Do the job right, we get more customers, you know, all that stuff, etc, etc. I love my job, definitely don't hate my job, I'm not disgusted by my job, I like doing my job, this is why I studied it, I'm still a doctor doing this after all these years, but I say I love my job, and I'm definitely not lying about that statement, what the freak is that? Oh my, these dudes are harvesting, they're digging deep man, they're digging deep, they're digging, what the freak is this, like some kind of lice or something, like a mite? Oh my goodness, okay, let's uh, scan you up, huh? What be you? An aquatic blood-sucking louse. It cannot be left in the corner. I know! So we're probably gonna burn these dudes down. Burn them down. You don't like it. Well, you don't like it either. Okay, I like these ones more than the worms, because look, they just do that, and then we can just get rid of them. Yes, I appreciate you guys. That's the weirdest thing I've said. Much better than those worms that embed themselves into this place. Standard day on the job, right? Standard day on the job. So now we gotta, we gotta do some serious rinsing right now, guys. This is the power wash tool. Look at all this. I washed them all the way down. Like, no, you can skip that. Like, I'll, I'll do a little bit, and then the current can carry them. Otherwise, like, nah, this is just this is off limits to me. There we go. You can be gone, all your little fragments. Oh, my gosh. We got a whole fish just chilling down here. Is that a barb? What? I don't even know. I, like, do I need to really know what that is? We know how we treat that thing. Pull it out. Wait, wait, wait. Why are you alive, bro? Why are you? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, dog. What was in that pizza? Uh, hang on, let me just scan you, Seb, before you go on your- Eww, what's that in his eyeball? What the heck? Scan it, scan it, scan it! The fish does not like it has been ingested. Yeah, well, that's gonna come out whole too, okay? Okay, okay, okay. That makes me feel even more weird. Why? Oh, you gotta all go, you gotta all go. This is where the job gets weird, man. This is where the job gets very, very weird, huh? All right, all right. But why? But why? why? Absolutely normal day on the job. Don't worry about it, guys. Look, man, I've seen some things in my life. You think this is the weird one? Oh, wait till you see what Thursday and Friday's got for us, man. This is comical. I literally want to leave these hooks in, man. Oh, my God. I'm, like, agitated with how long this game takes to do. And the thing is, like, it makes you repeat the same task. 
literally hundreds of times. Like, I get the point, okay? You don't have to make us do this that many times, man. Come on. Last two hooks. Yes, it looks clear. It looks clear. I think I've helped my man. No, don't. Oh my god, why is there more? Why is there a seashell inside of him, man? How fresh are we talking? May I have? May I have? Can I have? Hey, what, what, what's going- I want that. Perfect pearl. Well, let me take it then. Let me take the perfect- Make it an imperfect pearl. Cauterize it? Ah. Well then. Thanks for that. Just gonna get past you now, right? Okay. All right, this game is very, very weird. I've never seen a parasite infestation as bad as this. The biological waste bag that contains the extracted parasites undulates as it sits on your desk. The fisherman was shocked to see what came out of him. Perhaps he will cook his food from now on. He left your office looking a bit shocked and weak, but you, but knew within a few hours he should feel much better. He, you sent numerous specimens to the lab for analysis. Perhaps you have discovered a new species. At home that evening, you sit with a Latin dictionary and look for interesting words to use for new parasite. He really wanted that thing. Your wife cooks you spaghetti, but you cannot eat it without wrenching. Instead, you sit on the sofa and eat ice cream from the tub. You hope tomorrow will be a boring day. Me too, but it <laughs> Why though? Let's just get it over with, man. I'm, I'm ready for the end of this week already. Meat. Okay. You can probably tell by my appearance that I enjoy eating food. My job is to write about food at restaurants. Though I would not class myself as a critic because I am really disappointed by food. My favorite type of food is barbecue. I have written more words about barbecue than any other subject. Ah! What, what's in there? You look like you're in severe pain. Yes, the pain in my bowels is terrible. It is as if my bowels are getting excited at the prospect of more food and demanding that I eat. That is not exactly how it works. But I can feel it. I can hear it. I hear something in my mind demanding more food. It grips me from within and knows that I am in pain. The pain stops when I give it food and controls me. I cannot say that I have ever encountered any symptoms like these in the medical literature. But I can see you are suffering and I want to stop it. I think we should get started immediately. Okay. Thank you. Okie dokie, Thursday. Yeah. What comes after that is Friday. I just want a day where, like, the game gives me the message that this is kind of weird, but doesn't overstay its welcome. The game's done a good job of doing that. Like, instead of making you do it 10, maybe 20 times, you literally do it, like, 80 to 100 times, guys. I'm cutting out so much content here because it is so monotonous. But this is the job, and that's probably why it pays so well. It pays to do the monotony, right? It pays to try and... Hey, uh, sir? You want to talk about this? This is not normal. A human eyeball that appears to be rooted inside the colon? Remove it so I can be... Why? But why? Oh, but it said analyze it. But I can't. I can't analyze it. I must cauterize it. Maybe there's something else I can do. I don't feel like this is right. This cannot be analyzed in this state. So we can do this too? Okay, what about number five? Like, this doesn't seem to... What about if we give it current and then maybe, like, try and pull it? Nah, bro. Can we pull it multiple times? Like, it's just... It's glued on there. You can't get that. The problem is, there's no way anyone's gonna believe us, right? No one is gonna believe us that this is what we saw today. Some teeth in there, bro. Your intestines chewing... Okay, I'm starting to believe this, man. What the heck's going on? Human tooth growing. We remove that for analyzation? Yeah. Get some of those. Look, there's some canines in there, sir. You know that? Did you know that? <laughs> Guess now I do. I hate it when you can't see where the blood is coming from. What are you looking at, huh? What are you looking at? Like, guys, oh my gosh. The game makes a statement, okay? The game makes sure that you know this game is like, I'm weird. And I'm going to make sure you remember I'm weird. So much so that when you go to bed, you're going to be seeing this like the Tetris effect almost. But instead, this ain't no game of Tetris. This is a game of uh, whatever this is. I do wonder what it's all adding up to, though. It's, it's so weird. Like, what is the meaning of all of this, you know, man? Why are we seeing all of this? What would be the purpose? Is it even real? You know, that's the next question I'm asking. Are we just a bit delusional? Where did that tooth go, by the way? It just like popped out and it disappeared. Is that it? How'd it get back there? Oh my gosh, bro, I get it. There's teeth growing in here. I get it. Please, let this be over. <laughs> okay, first checkpoint done. We cleared out the teeth and eyeballs. What next, huh? Noses and mouths. How weird are we talking? The music's different. Music is a little bit different. I, I just wanna, where's my booster? Where's my special booster on this thing? This is cool technology. Guys, it's an ear. It's just an ear. Join the sound of this. Yep, great, good for you. Good for you, I ear. It's weird back here. <laughs> what you can do is listen, you can't respond. You love my jokes. Just says remove it from the car so it can be analyzed, but you can't, like, I don't, what, like, what do you want me to do? Like this? Oh my, it's gonna explode. Yeah, it, that, I, I, does that count? Maybe the fragments will be enough. 
right? Maybe. What the freak? Ugh! Ew! No, 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 no. This music should not be epic like this. This is disgusting. To a whole nother... What do I do? Do I pull it out? Fingers? Fingers? <gasps> Yo, they're attached like bones. Look at that. What the freak? Ew, it's so weird. It's so weird. It makes no sense. And you know what? I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that by this point because I think an explanation would be even more traumatic and weird, man. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So this is the thing that you said talk to your sir. Maybe he wasn't lying. He feels it all. When he eats, he feels better. It's like he seems they love to have a grasp on the food that he consumes. Only then does he feel somewhat quaint, content happy with everything. I love how just randomly there's just sweet corn, like just one sweet corn. We've got eyes, we've got weird things, and just like, sweet corn. Why does there have to be so many? I got it! Weird fingers in the body, but come on, there's so... Dude, I'm going insane. I'm going insane. My patience is wearing thin. I'm about to uninstall this game. All right, here we go. Please tell me I'm done. I know we're gonna have one more section, but at least for this one, please. Okay, two-thirds of the way through, a little bit more to go. What next are we gonna see? What's gonna be more horrific than that? We've had uh, all but like nose and mouth on the face, right? All but nose and mouth. And I don't think I want that to be seen. Uh, maybe the weird stuff's done, right? Maybe it can just be uh, nice and tranquil by this point. It's our expectation that's the problem. Because we need to see something even more bizarre, even more creepy. Wait, what's that? Scan it. Uh, it looks like a fang of some kind, like a like a tooth. Yeah, it's it's just a tooth. Okay, well, move it the same way as before. The same thing we've always done, multiple times over and over again. All for the money, right? Wait, what 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 type of food does he do review? He said he loved barbecue food. Um, but I think you you know, insides loved something else a bit more. Like they wanted to chew that food again. They loved it that much, you know. It'd be sick if it like changed the game up just randomly and it just got super dark, confusing. I would love that, but so far it's uh. Kind of just doing this, man. We're gonna get back out and tell him, like, oh, sir. Uh, so, we're gonna have to uh, question what food you've been eating. I'd like you to keep a food diary. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Is that dude a cannibal? I've just realized. Is he barbecuing people and eating everything? Ears, teeth, and all? What about if that's the case? We're dealing with a murderer. That'd be kind of cool, right? That'd be kind of weird, you know? I'm a colonoscopy dude, and I did a colonoscopy on this man, and I found uh, a missing person's remains. I think that's all the teeth taken care of. And they're making their way out. This is going to be a very interesting, uh, you know, turn of events when he leaves. Wait, what the heck is that? Uh, wait, no, seriously, what is that? What the f***? <laughs> Sir, um, I have found your brother. It appears to be a small version of our patient's head. It is growing from within his colon and is demanding food. Ah, is it now? Oh, 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 oh. oh should I stop? I feel bad! <gasps> Why is the more? I thought that was weird though. I thought that was it. Why is the more? Why did it scream like that? We just take this? How about we just sample this one, right guys? <gasps> we actually can. No way. Uh, so sir, um, look, I am not the one who can explain that. But I will pass it on to the people who hopefully can. We need the game to do more things like that. That was interesting. It was short and interesting. We don't need 15 minutes of teeth pulling from an intestine. There is nothing in the medical literature that explains what you just saw. But after it was all over, your patient's demeanor had changed completely. He stood up straight with a big smile on his face. He thanked you profusely and left your office looking like a new man. You cleared the rest of the day's schedule and you went home early. You went with your wife to your favorite park for a nice stroll. Afterwards, you both sat on the bench by the lake and fed the ducks. You are glad tomorrow is Friday. Yeah, me too, man. One more day of this. I don't blame it why this dude, this is last week, man. I'll quit after this thing. All right, let's get it done, man. Let's get it done. One more day, the blockage. W were they not all blockages of some form? My bowels feel very strange and uncomfortable, like I have something stuck inside me. And the problem has become worse over the past week. I hope it is not a tumor or anything like that. Yeah, that would be serious. I felt perfectly fine until a week ago. Tumors take a lot longer to grow, as do polyps and similar problems. I am less inclined to believe that you have something growing inside you. We won't know until we look, but it may be food related. Do you chew your food sufficiently? Yes, of course. I have mostly eaten soup in the past week and peanuts. Well, that's very specific. I work in the circus with elephants and I have access to a lot of peanuts. Do you eat an unusually large quantity of those? Only a handful or two per day. I sort of constantly nibble on them. Are your bowel movements unusual? 
My bowel movements are perfectly normal as far as I can tell. Though in the past week they have been smaller in size, which I find concerning. My food intake has not changed. Very strange indeed. I think I shall loop up my instrument to dive in. Doc's like, hey, I wanna know what's going on in there, though. Be gentle. Come on, Doc, you do it. Always. Why is this oddly sexual? All right, final procedure. I hope it's, uh, kind of normal. But I don't think it's gonna be like, if it's just peanuts everywhere, are we not just gonna be able to wash them out? Do we really have to do anything else? Are they somehow gonna make things bleed? Do we have to cauterize the peanuts? Let me guess, they're living creatures all of a sudden. It's gonna take forever for us to deal with them. That's gonna be the game logic here. That, or we're just gonna see normal stuff, like this. Which really shouldn't be normal, but hey, at least we can treat normal. Right guys, it may be boring, but it's normal. The key word here, normal. There it is, look, I knew it. They're just, they're just chilling. They're just down here chilling, like, hey, how you doing? Uh, water ride, let's go. Whee! And that was me, that was the doctor, you know? That was me just having some fun. Circus guy's like, Doc, what the heck you doing, man? I'm just like, shut up, I'm talking to the peanuts as they slide down your intestines, don't talk. Wait, what's that? Hold up, that's not good. That means there's something else here, right? That's what that means. Yeah, so we got a visitor. We're gonna use that term, okay? Visitor. What freak is that? Wait, what is that? Dude's eating the cashew nuts with the skin. Look, he's leaving the, the, like, the outer shell thing on them. Cashew nut is that? Oh, it's a peanut. Okay, my bad. Look, guys, my, my nut knowledge might be kind of bad. That sounds very weird, but it's technically true. What is that? What is that? Is that just uh, more peanuts? I'd love that if so. Like, I love it when it's an easy job, you know? Just wash a little bit, you know? Yes, it is. Thank goodness. Oh, I think I'm going off food, guys. You know, I think I'm, I think I'm going off uh, all kinds of food. I don't know when I'll be able to really get that joy back. Maybe I won't ever do that. And maybe this is the new diet supplement. Play this game here, a game about being a colonoscopist. and Learn why you shouldn't eat, um, barbecue? What else? Sweet, well, sweet corn's fine, I guess. Uh, peanuts get the past two. Um, I think that's it. Just wait, what? How much do I sleep? I question my sleep hygiene. We're gonna have to get to bed earlier tonight. There is a door. Doc? Hello? Permission to enter the interior of the large intestine. Permission, I guess, is granted, and so I will go through. I will not be rude for my guest. I didn't know we had doors inside of us, man. If we did, I'd, uh, you know, I'd be getting my cod liver oil and, you know, oil up that section of the body. Ah, uh, okay. Um. All right, what's this? Hang on, I think you said you were eating peanuts. This does not look like a peanut. It's not like a tooth. A fang? We got fat. Hang, hang on. Wait, what were you doing in the circus, huh? Eating the tigers? What's going on? Too much of the same, minus the fangs. So it's not really a whole lot of the same. Uh, what are we gonna find next? Uh, what, like, what is your circus act, by the way, sir? What do you do? Eat fangs? Is that literally your your job, your role in the uh, the circus thing? Because you gotta be doing something here, right? Wait, what? Bro takes his job way too seriously. He's like, no, I'm a circus man on the outside, and I'm a circus man on the inside. What the? What the? Whoa, hey, bud! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, uh, yeah. Back to that sleep question, dog. How much is sleep and it's not enough? We got a little camera. We got a little camera. Like, hey, bro, look at this. Look at this. I know this is inside your body. You probably don't want to, uh, you know, be in this operating room right now. You probably want to be somewhere a lot more urgent, but uh, check this out. It's kind of weird. What would you do if you had a clown doing this near your butthole? from the inside though, so you can never get to it. Like, what would you do? Would you be glad about that? I'd be so annoyed, like I'm just trying to sleep and just someone's playing like uh, the circus tune over and over again. Like, shut the heck up with that, I'm trying to sleep. Stop doing this, stop also putting fangs in my bowels, it's weird. How are we gonna stop him? The, the, the objective is gonna be to stop this guy, right, doing this. He's surely only got so many teeth, unless he's really got the, uh, the unlimited package right there, which he might well do. Look at him back there. Hey, what are you eating? Hey, stop that, you understand? If you, if you eat too much of him, you're dead. Bro, he's losing his teeth when he does that. One absolute menace to society. This is definitely, uh, yeah, the weirdest thing I've done so far in my gaming career, or at least one of. It's definitely up there. There's no wonder this dude was like, I'm out after this. Like, why are these new parasites, these new infections? I didn't know what these even existed. I'd leave too. So let's keep moving through it. We're probably gonna have to have a showdown with him, like a boss battle. You know what I love about this game? It literally uses all the same music I use in my, uh, my videos, guys. You've probably heard most of these. This is not me putting the music over the top. I'm going in with a quarterizer. Straight in the eyeball. Don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look. Wait, should I go his eyeball? I go his eyeball. Go his eyeball, here we go. Take 
Dragon. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Last time. I don't want to know what sound that was, bro. What do you make that sound? Like, bedroom? Like, what, what was that? What was that whimpering, you know? Wait. He's, like, crying. Well, if you would stop eating my uh, associate's intestinal lining, maybe you could both learn to get along and this wouldn't be going down. But instead, you're not making this easy, sir. You are actually the root cause of the problem. All I ball down. You're not eating now, are you, huh? Yeah, you see me. You see me. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Try it. Try it. I dare you. I dare you. Yeah, your roars don't scare me. I'm a drone. I'm strong. Ouch. Oh, this is some weird bullcrap. What the freak is going on in this game? <laughs> Why is the actual bopping music coming through? It's building. Oh, it's building. Oh, it's building. Oh, it's building. It's all building. It's all building. So is this blockage. And I gotta clear it. And I gotta get rid of you. You weird clown baby crying man thing that makes strange moaning sounds when he backs up weirdly. You can't hear me. Hey, stop lying, man. Stop lying. I'm gonna take your red nose off this time. I'm coming for that nose. Come for that nose. <laughs> Got your nose! Got your nose! Should I get it though? Odd. Odd one. Odd one. Trusty sweet corn! On your way! With the uh, other things that are going through here. Oh, look, he's got teeth in the walls now. All over again. I don't think I've uh, missed a single tooth in this game or, like, a single injury. I should have washed everything out. At least I hope so. We gotta go. We gotta go. I'm gonna go around with this thing with the cutter. If he jump scares me, dead. Wait. Look at him. Dude's crying. Dude's bawling. He doesn't know what's going on. Where do we aim? The, maybe the teeth. Let's break those teeth, though. Break those teeth, though. He can still hear me. He can still hear me. There you go. There you go. Maybe this? Ouch! Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa. Body just absorbs that. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's let's remove all this. Remove all this. I, I'm doing another job. I'll do anything but this. I really will. I am over this job, this profession. Yep. I'm all done. I quit. I'm done. I'm done with this life, man. It was not what I intended or what I really thought when I'd be doing this job. I thought it was helping people. Instead, I'm just, I'm fighting demons within. A triumphant end to a challenging week. All of your patients went on to make a full recovery. The medical research community was thrilled with all of the data and specimens you provided them with. But you felt you had reached your peak as a practitioner and decided to retire. You occasionally give guest lectures at all important medical schools and conferences around the world. Life is peaceful and you devote your time to your family and your hobbies. You live out the rest of your life in happiness. <laughs> No explanation about finding a circus man's face. Oh my god, they just throw you back at the menu and like, yeah, thanks for coming. You know what's going on, and yeah, that's it. What the freak is this game? I don't get it, but I don't, I don't understand what else I should get. Look, guys, we, we, you know, have some wild adventures here and there. We have some highs, we have some lows, and then we have some colonoscopy experiences. This was a game called Revenge of the Colon, bro. There is apparently four endings for this game. I guess playing through them, maybe one is not helping the patients at all. Another one is, I, well, I don't know. How can you get those other endings? I'm genuinely curious right now. Either way, that was my experience. Yeah, definitely a weird game. Body horror for sure. I'm going to have to put like a warning in the title for this thing because this is a very disturbing and gross game. This got to me quite a few times. Overall, a bit monotonous i would say that it took way too long to get to like the whole point of this game i feel like it could have been half the length of the game and i would have still been satisfied paying what i did for this thing lots of repetition and very very slow with the movement like if your movement speed was increased a little bit more i feel like i would have enjoyed this a lot more but hey we still played through the whole of this thing we got the adventure if you guys want to play revenge of the colon for yourself you can find the link down below but that's going to be it for this video and i really hope you did enjoy if you did why not drop that like rate? and hey if you're new around here want to subscribe for more videos just like this one right here so thanks so much for watching this video guys of course hope you did enjoy the next time I hear my belly start grumbling, I'm gonna be paranoid. I got a little clown in there or something.